what's up youtube it's neeraj from tech unbox and welcome to an another video in today's video we are going to unbox a lg q6 and have a first look at this device so if you guys are new here do subscribe to our channel and let's get started all right guys here we have the box of the LG Q6. We have the LG Q6 branding on the box and this box shows that this device has a full vision display with an aspect ratio of 18 by 9. Speaking of the MRP of this device, it comes for 14,990 but I bought it for 13k rupees. So let's unbox this device and see how does it looks like. Let's cut through the seals of this box and let's open it. Opening up the box, we have the LG Q6 on top of that which is wrapped in a plastic. Let's take it out of the box and it looks very good, first impressions though are very good. For now let's keep it to the side and take a look at the other contents inside the box. Inside this box we have the user manual, warranty card and a SIM ejector tool. And here we have a power adapter which is a 5 watt charger so it's not gonna charge your phone very fast it's a normal charger and I think this phone also does not support any fast charging that's why there is no fast charger with this device we have a micro USB to USB cable and inside this tiny box we have the very basic earphones or we can say very cheap quality headphones keeping all the things to the side let's take a look at the LG Q6 so guys first thing first Let's move the plastic protector from the phone. So guys here we have the LG Q6 which is looking very good. I have the platinum color of this device. First impressions of the device are very great and it feels not that heavy. Comparing this device with the LG G6 we may find that the LG G6 looks like a flagship smartphone and the Q6 looks like a budget smartphone. Although the back of the phone is made up of plastic but it does not feel like a cheap smartphone. Thanks to the metal frame all around the body and the overall construction of the device is very well and we can say that it is a well built device. So friends let's take a physical overview of the device. And on the front side of the device we have a 5.5 inch full HD display and a 5 megapixel front facing camera. Moving on to the back side we have a plastic back and a 13 megapixel f2.2 camera and a LED flash. And we have a mono speaker to the back of this device. Towards the bottom we have a 3.5 mm headphone jack, a micro USB port and a primary microphone for making calls and other things. To the left side we have the volume up and down button and two sim slots one is for secondary sim and the another is for primary sim and a memory card both the slot ports nano sims to the other side of the phone we have the power on and off button so guys that is the overview of the device now let's boot this device for the very first time booting up the device we have the lg q6 a powered by android logo on the screen by the time this device boots up let's talk about the specification of the device it comes with Snapdragon 435 octa-core processor which is a 1.4 GHz CPU and we have an Adano 405 GPU and this phone comes with 3 GB of RAM and an 32 GB of internal storage which is expandable up to 256 GB via a SD card. We have a 5.5 inch display with a resolution of 1080x2160 and this display has an PPI of 442 pixels. We have a Corning Gorilla Glass 3 protection. We have a 13 megapixel f2.2 autofocus camera with LED flash and a 5 megapixel front facing camera. And this phone comes with Android 7.1.1 Nougat with LG UI 5.0 skin on top of that. And this phone weights almost around 149 grams. So guys the device is ready now I have quickly boot this up for you. As you can see that we have LG UI 5.0 on this phone with no home drawer at all. Most of the peoples don't like the LG skin on top of the Android. Even I don't like this skin. I would like to go with the Nova launcher. Other than that the performance of the device is very good. It handles most of the apps and the multitasking very well. I can say that it handles all the day to day tasks very well. 
now friends let's talk about the most impressive thing about this device which is the 18.9 aspect ratio full vision display it is a 1080 by 2160 display and it is very crispy and the colors looks very vivid if we compare this display with any of the smartphone at this price range then i think it's one of the kind and it is the one of the best looking display at the price range Watching videos on this display feels very great on 18.9 ratio screen. The only problem is that the YouTube app on this phone does not support 18.9 aspect ratio. So we have the black bars on the top and bottom of the screen. So in YouTube we have no use of this aspect ratio. Other than that it is a very good display at this price and it gives an immersive viewing pleasure while watching videos on this display. So friends, speaking of the cameras on this device, both the rear and the front cameras looks very good and they capture really very amazing photographs. These cameras are very fast and very responsive. In daylight, these cameras capture very good images what in low light there is a lot of noise in the frame because of the high ISO settings and these cameras produces very blurred images in low light condition but we cannot expect more at this price and the rear camera is capable of recording 1080p videos at 30 frames per second so overall it is a great package to have so friends this is the unboxing and the first impression of the lg q6 i hope you guys have enjoyed watching this video do hit the like button and do subscribe to our channel Thank you for watching this video and I will catch you guys in my next awesome video.